In the world of professional football, there are tales of extraordinary rise to stardom and unfortunate falls from grace. One such story revolves around Andre Rison, a talented wide receiver who soared to the heights of success with the Atlanta Falcons, only to experience a tragic downfall that would leave a mark on his career forever. Born on March 18, 1967, in Flint, Michigan, Andre displayed his passion and talent for football from an early age. Growing up in a city known for its rich football culture, he was determined to make a name for himself. His electrifying speed, remarkable agility, and exceptional catching ability quickly caught the attention of scouts and coaches alike. Andre's high school career was nothing short of exceptional. His dynamic playing style and ability to make jaw-dropping catches turned him into a local legend. With each game, his reputation grew, and college recruiters flocked to see him in action. Practicing with Andre was incredible. He pushed us to be better, always giving 110% and pushing the limits of what we thought was possible. I owe a lot to my high school coaches and teammates. They believed in me and pushed me to be the best version of myself. It was during those years that I truly fell in love with the game. His talents did not go unnoticed by college football powerhouses. He received numerous scholarship offers and ultimately decided to attend Michigan State University. In college, he continued to dazzle with his exceptional skills and became a focal point of the Spartans' offense. He set several school records, including the most receiving yards in a season and the most touchdowns in a career. In 1989, his dreams turned into reality when he was selected by the Atlanta Falcons as the 22nd overall pick in the NFL Draft. With his arrival in Atlanta, he became an instant sensation, thrilling fans with his incredible athleticism and becoming a key player in the Falcons' offense. Andre time with the Falcons was nothing short of spectacular. He was a dynamic force on the field, renowned for his acrobatic catches and ability to turn routine plays into touchdowns. His impact extended beyond the field. His charisma and magnetic personality made him a fan favorite, and he embraced his role as a sports icon. His flashy style, highlighted by his signature touchdown celebration dance, made him instantly recognizable and endeared him to fans across the nation. As his stardom grew, so did his off-field presence. He became a cultural icon, adorning magazine covers, appearing on television shows, and basking in the spotlight. With his flashy style and charismatic personality, Andre embraced his status as one of the NFL's biggest stars. His popularity reached its peak during the 1993 season, where he led the league in receiving yards and helped propel the Falcons to their first playoff appearance in nearly a decade. His impact on the game was undeniable, and he was widely regarded as one of the best wide receivers in the NFL. However, amidst the glitz and glamour, there were signs of trouble brewing beneath the surface. Andre's flashy lifestyle and penchant for controversy began to overshadow his on-field accomplishments. He developed a reputation for being difficult to work with, clashed with coaches and teammates, and his off-field antics often made headlines for all the wrong reasons. But as the saying goes, the higher you climb, the harder you fall. In 1994, Andre's life took a tragic turn that would tarnish his legacy and overshadow his accomplishments on the field. On June 22, 1994, news broke that his mansion in Georgia had caught fire, resulting in substantial damage. Investigations later revealed that the fire was started by Andre's girlfriend during a heated argument. This incident not only made headlines nationwide, but also marked the beginning of a downward spiral for him. The fire was a turning point in his life. It not only caused significant financial loss, but also strained his relationship with the Falcons organization. The team traded him to the Cleveland Browns in 1995, hoping a change of scenery would help him move past the incident and refocus on his football career. However, Andre time in Cleveland was marred by inconsistency and off-field issues. He struggled to find the same level of success he had enjoyed in Atlanta, and his performance on the field suffered as a result. The flashes of brilliance that had once defined his game became fewer and farther between. Off the field, his personal life continued to be turbulent. 
he faced legal issues, including charges related to domestic violence, which further tarnished his reputation. The once beloved star was now struggling to regain his footing, both professionally and personally. Andre once illustrious career was now plagued by controversies, legal troubles, and a series of failed comebacks. The player who had once electrified stadiums and commanded respect on the field found himself struggling to regain his former glory. His story serves as a reminder that fame and success do not guarantee happiness or fulfillment. The pressures of the spotlight and the temptations that come with success can lead even the most talented individuals down a destructive path if they are not grounded and surrounded by a strong support system. Today, Andre looks back on his rise to stardom and the unfortunate turn his life took. He has since embraced his mistakes and has become an advocate for personal growth and overcoming adversity. He shares his experiences with young athletes, emphasizing the importance of making good choices, surrounding oneself with positive influences, and seeking help when needed. The rise to stardom and unfortunate fall of Andre serves as a cautionary tale, reminding us that true success goes beyond the bright lights and accolades. It lies in the choices we make, the way we navigate challenges, and our ability to rise above adversity. His journey is a reminder that no matter how high we climb, we must always remain grounded and true to ourselves. He continues to inspire and motivate others through his perseverance and determination. He is a living testament to the power of redemption and personal growth. From his rise to stardom to his unfortunate fall, his story serves as a reminder that it's not about how we fall, but how we rise again. His journey reminds us that we can overcome the darkest moments and find our way back to the light. It's a lesson we can all learn from, both on and off the field. 